Hi everyone, this is Mary for Stamping Camp with Mary and Mary's Stamping Happenings and today is Tips and T Techniques Tuesday. Okay, for now what I'd like to do is show you how to use the, um, the mason jar shaker domes and the um, jar um, punch. Okay. All right, like that. And um, I'm just going to show you how to put it together. I will be showing you probably a card that I made with it in a little bit. So what you need is you need a piece of card stock. Now I just got this a regular card base. Let's bring this up. Um, but you could use um, just a card front um, or even a smaller place, depending upon where you want to put your um, jar. If you just use a card base like this, you really only can do the jar closer to the bottom than the top, okay? And I'll show you. We're just going to punch this out. And you've got this cute little thing. So you could, if you wanted to, you could also just um, put the... Uh, put the little jar thing on there and just punch it out. Okay, now what you want to do is, if you're going to put any of the um, flowers or anything on the top of that jar, you want to do it now, okay? So I'm going to take my flowers and ink them up with, and I'm just doing this, this is just a memento black. I'm not making this a really great card or anything. I'm just going to put that on like that. Now, it also depends upon what you want to put inside. You don't have to put anything inside if you want. You could close it up and you can stamp um, this on a piece of Whisper White cardstock. Let me cut this down a little bit and I'll show you how you can do that. So I'm just going to use a, a four by a five and a quarter or so. You could just stick this in line it up. You don't want to to put it on. You don't want to um, attach it yet. Just line it up and then you can um, uh, stamp the, let's see, let's just do that. Stamp. Just like that. Now you could do a, a few other things. You could put some uh, gel in here or whatnot. But the first thing you want to do is you want to take your mason jar and you're going to want to take off the top piece of that white because it's sticky underneath that you just want to take off that top piece of the adhesive thing. Don't want to take off the bottom piece right now. Just want to take off that top piece. And then what you're going to do is you're just going to pop this in. And then you're going to stick that down. And there you got. Now you could, again, you can put a little marbles in there. You can put any sequins. What I have done is I uh, have cut out there are, where is it? This isn't the one. Oh, there it is. I've cut out some flowers for from a, another die. And I'm just going to stick some flowers in there. Because, you know, our flowers just, our petals just sometimes just die and they go into the water. 
So I'm just cutting those out. Just placing those in there. Okay. Now what I want to do is this is where this is important. So you need to know where this is. So what I like to do then is I'm just going to take a pencil or a pen and I am going to 